me, um, maybe a little confused about how to do this one. So I thought I'd put together a few short videos that will walk you through this. And, and this is how I would take this approach if I were looking at this. So we have a, a normal grid, just like any other. We have an x-axis and a y-axis. We have positive and negative. And you'll notice in the first challenge, it says, program the VR robot to move the coordinates to the negative 500, 700. So negative 500 and then up to 700. So I'm going to come here to zero. I'm going to move over to negative 500, which is right here. I'm going to move up to 700. And my answer is going to be 83. So in this box, I'm going to write 80. Excuse my, I'm doing this with a mouse. So I don't know what that's doing. It's 83, not 87. Um, I promise you. So um, there we go. 83. That's going to be the answer. I would find the answers before I even start worrying about the programming. In the next section, it says to find these different coordinates. So what is negative 300, negative 900? What's that number? So I'm going to come over here to negative 300. Then we'll go down to negative 900. And my number is 4. Okay, so that's the first number that I'm looking for. And I would write in this box a 4. <laughs> Again, it's acting a little weird for me, but we'll get through it. Then I have 700 and 700. So I'm going to come up here and I'm going to go up my scale to 700, which is between 600 and 800, right? And then I'm going to come over here to 600 and 800, because that's what 700 is here. And my number is what? It's 89. So again, down here, I'm going to write 89. So I'll put an 8 and a 9 in there. And it's going to look like a lollipop. All right. I'm going to let you figure out these two. All right, so I'll let you kind of go through using what I just demonstrated to do that. Now, the last one's kind of a reverse. It tells you the number, and you're going to write the coordinates. So let's do number 22 together. So we're going to scroll up to here, and on my chart, I find 22. 22 is right here. Well, if you look, on my x-axis, I'm at negative 700, and on my y-axis, I'm at negative 500. So my coordinates that I will write in here are negative 700, and I'm going to do my best, 700, right? And I'm going to write, uh, and then I'm going to put a little semicolon, or a, I don't care what you write in there, then you're going to put negative 500, and it's not going to work with me so well, but you kind of get the point. It's going to look like these, how they wrote them up here, okay? So that's the first step in what we're doing. So that's the end of this tutorial video. It kind of shows you how we're finding the numbers. I want you to find the numbers and write them in here first. And then in the series of the next couple of or tutorials, I'll walk you through how we program our robots to actually land on those numbers.